Jay, a handful of people showed up to voice their concerns to the Wichita Police Department tonight. This is the first of four meetings to help improve police and community relationships. Cakes Monica Castro was at the meeting tonight where our conversations got a bit heated about community policing. Monica. Tonight, not only did they discuss a department-wide assessment, one of the areas that people want to see improved is community policing. Some say police need to make more of an effort to have more conversations with people in the community. In this small group, the conversation got heated when talking about community policing and what it means. The concern is the community not communicating with law enforcement without the community policing. David Brown says police need to be more approachable. Community policing is something where you, you the officers have to park that cruiser and get out and walk and get to know the, the teenagers, get to know who's doing what. One man who attended the meeting feels mending community relations shouldn't just apply to minorities. Police are mean to white people too and treat white people unfairly too in this matter. Uh, what I see in here is what I'm concerned about is affirmative action policing. While this comment may have hit a sour note, many say that's why meetings like this help WPD to bridge the gap. It did anger a lot of people. All the cards need to be put on the table so that we can understand each other. Now it opens the door to say, okay, they're concerned as well. City Manager Robert Layton says this is a start to mending community police relations. And that's why the selection of the next chief is so important, so that that person can help lead the discussion inside and outside of the department about what the future of community policing will be. With this meeting like this right now, maybe the change is slowly coming. Maybe the change is slowly, you know, getting there. Tonight, people brought up the need for police training when it comes to dealing with the mentally ill as well as racial profiling, especially when it comes to making traffic stops. The other big topic was how to recruit minority groups into the police force. The next scheduled meeting is for March 10th.